different is the atmosphere in a rivalry game like this one? Yeah, Kev, we sense it on the sideline, don't we? We do, yes. You know, a little bit of an air of dislike, a growing discontent that you're constantly in each other's way. Rivalries are built when teams consistently meet when there is something on the line. And that is what has happened with these two. And I'll tell you, we get to sit back and enjoy it, Kevin. When you played Doris, were those the most fun games for you as a player? No doubt. No doubt you wanted to beat that team that was always standing in your way. So then in the summertime, you had a little bragging right. Here are the starters for Los Angeles. All out there with LeBron James. Then there's Kyle Kuzma. Then it's Brandon Ingram. And it's McGee in at the center position. Here's James. And James throws it down hard. That is why the ticket price is what it is when LeBron is in town. Amazing dunk to finish the play. And that was an Unleash Chaos replay, courtesy of Under Armour, wreaking havoc at the rim. Now, here's Curry. From deep, the long distance three is buried. Curry's got six. And he likes to get in a rhythm early. Nice triple. The drive by LeBron. And the dunk by James. I'll tell you, if you get caught napping on the defensive end, that first step of LeBron's is so explosive. Look out. The Warriors have gone two or three here to start out the game. Left side, Curry. Another three for Golden State. Boy, not a bad beginning. Three for four from the floor. Pretty good start. For Los Angeles, they've gone three of four from the field to start out the game. And oh boy, a lot of contact there, but he gets the call and will shoot two. It's on Kevin Durant. And LeBron James last season not slowing down even a little bit. Turned in. Doris, one of his best seasons yet. Isn't it amazing how impactful LeBron is on the floor at all times? Last year, you think about his passing and rebounding numbers were as good as they've ever been. Only a handful of guys have ever changed the game like he can. You know, I think, guys, what's amazing to me is LeBron has been in his prime for over a decade at this point. And we all kind of keep waiting for father time to catch up. But who knows when that's going to happen? He doesn't get the second one. And Doris, normally players LeBron's age start to decline, but it isn't happening. Yeah, Kev. I mean, LeBron said he wants to be the player to break the mold and dominate into his late 30s. Listen, he wants to play with his oldest son, so we'll see what happens. Ingram, left side. Over Durant, and that one's good. Ingram. Ingram's got his first basket of the night. Boy, the offense is really clicking. Four for five from the field to start. Nice. Curry, good. There's a fearlessness that Steph Curry plays with. This guy enjoys getting into the paint and trying his luck with the big men. LeBron kicks to McGee. Back to LeBron. Fires from 14. Again, the Lakers. Boy, he's heating up fast coming out of the gate. Four out of five from the field. Curry against Ball. Cousins with a screen on Ball. Cousins inside, guarded by McGee. And so he earns a trip to the line. Officials saw the contact, and he'll shoot two. Marcus Cousins, really the big final name in free agency last summer to land with the team. And Greg, did he shock the NBA world with his selection? To take a one-year deal with the Warriors, nobody saw this coming. It makes sense for Boogie. Time to rehab and then join a contender for the back half of the season. You would think he'll get a much bigger and longer contract offer after this year. Looking at who's out there now for the Warriors. Jordan Bell's checked in for Draymond Green. Iguodala comes in for Kevin Durant. And it's Patrick McCaw in for Clay Thompson. Now here's Rondo. Picked him clean. And here we go. Fast break. Curry's got it. And it's blocked. LeBron against Bell. Bell with the block. Well, the high motor, versatile defender, Jordan Bell, twice on the pipes. The Warriors making a switch here. Livingston's checked in. Yo, 
just under three and a half minutes gone here in the first quarter. Boy, that's exactly how you have to play defense when he's driving the lane. You cannot give him any space. Warriors leading by four. And Bell kicks to McCaw. Pass to Cousins. Here's McCall. Covered by Beasley. Pocket two. Here's Livingston. No good from outside. For Los Angeles, they've gone five of eight from the field, shooting over 62%. It's tipped. It's stolen by Bell. Pushing it up for the finish. Throws down the breakaway jam. Well, this is where the athleticism and the long arms and quick thinking of Jordan Bell come into play. Here's James, and the layup's good off the glass. James has got 11 points. He has certainly done his part this period. Uh, just needs to get a little more help from his teammates. Here's McCall. He's guarded by Caldwell Pope. Here's Cousins, and he drops in the layup off the glass. And the story here, Kevin, early on is how well they shot the basketball. Hart kicks to James. Bill with the block. Releases from 15, and he overshot that one, missing. Lakers trail by six. Here's LeBron, and it's good coming on the assist by Rajon Rondo. And that's 13 points for LeBron. I'll tell you, he's doing everything scoring-wise this period to try to keep them in it. And the shot goes down. Well, this guy's so capable of using that handle to get off the dribble drive. How pretty is that move? And it's Beasley finishing it off. Boy, nice feed. Leading him into some space. A nice catch on the run, too. Wow. One second left, and the quarter ends with some stifling defense right there. It's been all about Stephen Curry for the Golden State Warriors. He witnessed him delivering a series of three-pointers as he notched three total in the quarter. We'll return shortly.